Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of Classic Candy Corner and these are pretty much they are classic um, this is another one of these ones that either you're gonna love it or you're gonna hate it <laughs> a lot of people think they're really gross and some people say oh yeah I love them they're like really weird and this one's not um particular this particular flavor is not really classic but the candy itself is and I thought this would be a little bit different to try for a change <laughs> the new version of it this is Swedish fish I know you know the Swedish fish and stuff but this is Swedish fish mini and it's it's crush fruit mix and it's grape and orange pineapple and strawberry so maybe that will uh, give a little bit uh, different twist on the classic flavor <laughs> I remember getting the Swedish fish in the um, uh, movies and, so, and they were, these are the mini ones the regular ones that came in the box were the big red ones and they were kind of flat yeah, orange pineapple grape and then there's fruit punch and I'm gonna go ahead and start with one see if it's any better <laughs> definitely chewy it's kind of got that weird gel flavor to it it doesn't really melt wow. I don't know mmm doesn't really taste like soda the orange one I don't know that this really improves the flavor very much okay that kind of tastes like orange but it's still got that weird kind of chewy gel flavor that you normally would get from the Swedish fish and <laughs> I mean I get those and uh, movie theater has big boxes of them where you get sometimes you get bags of them and um, all right that one's not bad it just tastes like pineapple but yeah uh, very um now a little bit more but we still got that strange kind of <clears throat> gel flavor and then it's got like a strange coating on the outside like a kind of oil i think they do that to like um make it shiny or kind of preserve that thing in there i don't know that um, these were some of my favorites the swedish fish uh, a lot of times you'd get them like um I think um, Valentine's Day and stuff, they would put them like little packets and stuff like that. Or Easter time, I guess. Sometimes maybe even for Halloween. Um, it wasn't one of my favorite ones. It had that very strange flavor to it. And that kind of oiliness and the really chewiness to it. Um, <laughs> they're very strange. Some people like all that kind of strange. It's not really like a gum drop. Like you'd have the drops or you'd have the um, jujubes. That's almost kind of what it's like. The jujube or juicy juji fruits. That kind of strange gum drop flavor. But the, and then these don't have a, a sugar coating on them. They're just weird, chewy, <laughs> and I don't know that I like the flavor as much but kind of does improve on it a little but um when they would get old they'd get like, all hard and they were very tough and kind of chewy so you want to make sure that they're kind of fresh and nice and soft almost like the gummy bears sometimes maybe you got to put them in your pocket let them warm up a little bit so they uh get a little bit chewy Ferris Bueller 
want some gummy bears? They've been in my pocket and they're nice and warm. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, Swedish Fish wasn't probably one of my favorite ones. I get them once in a great while. I don't know. So if you wanted to, you know, <laughs> relive some of your childhood memories, get yourself some Swedish Fish and, um, I don't know, <laughs> relive the past. <laughs> like I said, the flavor's not all that great. Um, I'd rather have like regular gumdrops, uh, dots, Sour Patch Kids even. That's kind of what it reminds me of the texture without the sour. Um, eh. If you wanted a chewy kind of gummy thing, go for the Swedish Fish. <laughs> um, it's very definitely gooey and chewy. Um, but it's that oil on the outside that kind of kills it, I guess. But maybe some people really like it. Um, share it with your friends, <laughs> I guess. Um, yeah, but it's definitely a classic candy. Been around for quite a while. And kind of one of those um, cult classic. That this is a, a cult classic kind of candy that you know you kind of love to hate it, hate to love it. <laughs> Everybody follows it, you know, they kind of go back and remember, oh yeah, Swedish fish, I remember having those, didn't like them, but I still eat them. Kind of go back and get things that are, um, you know, back from your childhood, kind of remember it, and then once you eat them, you kind of go, oh yeah, that's why I didn't like it. I did that with the the jujubes. The jujubes were those hard little little BB sized things and their flavors were awful. And then you kind of, once you take a bite and you remember, oh yes, that's why I did not like it. Kind of like this one maybe. Don't remember the Swedish fish all that often, but once you take one bite, you kind of go back to your childhood and go, oh yeah, that's right. Now I remember, I don't like them. But anyway. Yeah, you can get them pretty much anywhere. Um, they're usually in the boxes of bags, Dollar Tree, grocery stores. I don't know. They got them all over Walmart. They got a lot of different flavors now, too. I think there's a tropical one. There's the regular one, the minis. I don't know. Wherever you want. But if you want to go back and live, uh, you live your childhood, get some Swedish fish and give them a try. So anyways, there you go. That's kind of my memories of the uh, Swedish fish. They weren't all the pleasant memories, but they were memories just the same. So anyways, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over here. That way you won't miss any future content. Or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be reviewing something classic, like the Swedish fish for you, I am gonna put these aside and eh, maybe have a couple another time, so. Until next time, I'll talk to you later.